In the renewable industry, there's been a lot of different technological advancements. One of the, the advancements that has most influenced our clients is just the fact that turbines and, and solar panels have become uh, so much more efficient at generating electricity. They can now put solar in various different states where solar might not have made a lot of sense uh, on an economic perspective just because of the generating capacity of, of the solar panels. I'm Chris Jorgensen. I'm a lead scientist for the utility environmental team. There's been many people that have inspired me to pursue the sciences and pursue degrees in science. I think it really started with my, my family. My mom and dad used to take me on family vacations growing up and we would always go to various national parks and state parks. I think a typical work day for us really varies depending on the number of solar and wind energy projects we have going on and then what stages those projects are in as well. So if it's a early stage wind energy development, we might be designing survey protocols, working out logistics, and starting some of our bird and bat surveys that we have to do prior to construction, just to make sure that our clients are avoiding and minimizing impacts to wildlife as much as possible. If it's a, a late stage development project, we're likely working with clients to help them through and, and navigate through local permitting efforts. I think our culture is fantastic at Olson. The fact that our, our one of our tenets is we exist for our employees. That gives us the space to make decisions and formulate our decisions around our people and, and really make sure that we're looking out for one another. So when you demonstrate those kind of cultural values, I think it's contagious and it spreads to others throughout the firm.